Next, we will present the Target Tourism Champion Award of Excellence. And I would like to invite Seamus to the stage to present this award. Seamus. Hi, my name is Seamus. You might remember me from one of your favorite Newfoundland and Labrador commercials. Yes, that's a real number. With real Newfoundlanders and Labradorians ready to answer all of your questions about our beautiful province. This is the Newfoundland and Labrador welcome desk and operators are standing by. Hello, my name is Seamus. You might remember me from, uh, well, from that video you just saw. I'm one of the friendly faces of the Newfoundland and Labrador welcome desk, but just one of many, the many advertising campaigns dreamt up by my good friends at Target, the long-standing agency partner of the tourism department. You might say, eyes the buy that builds the boats, <laughs> and eyes the buy that sails her, but targets the buys that make amazing ads. <laughs> or at least, better than Verbal. <laughs> this year, Target is sponsoring the Tourism Champion Award and they asked me to do the honor of presenting because, well, I'm one of the faces of Newfoundland tourism. You see, you may know me as Seamus, but my mother knows me as Jeff Adams from Milton Trinity Bay. <laughs> Seamus is a job. See, and he needs these. <laughs> One that I am proud to have, same as Maggie and Joan, and of course, everyone behind the camera at the welcome desk. These are all jobs created by tourism and just a small sample compared to the accommodators, the food and bev establishments, attractions, and tour operators. Tourism is the engine of our economy. You and your businesses are why tens of thousands of Newfoundlanders and Labradorians go to work proudly every day, including me. So it's my honor to present this year's Tourism Champion Award, which recognizes individuals, companies, and organizations who give selflessly of their time and energy to champion the interests of and enhance our tourism industry. And the best thing about a tourism champion is that when they win, we all win. The whole province. So that's why I'm so pleased to announce this year's winner. A volunteer for 29 years, a leader with a strategic mind and the patience and perseverance to build up a world-class experience in the province. This year's tourism champion is truly a trailblazer. Congratulations, Randy Murphy, president of the East Coast Trail Association. Thank you, Seamus. Thank you, H&L. Just a few words of thank you. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, in May of 1995, I'm leaving 
the house for my first East Coast Trail meeting. I told my wife, Elizabeth Brand, who is with me tonight, uh, we'll be back in a couple of hours. Little did we know the meeting would last 29 years and counting. <laughs> and be before I go on, I'd like to recognize and thank Elizabeth Land for her support over those many years and for making it possible for me to, to do what I do. Thank you, Elizabeth Land. <laughs> uh, with great appreciation and love. I grew up in the town of Ascension, where I learned to love rural Newfoundland, the wilderness, and to appreciate and marvel at the wonders of our coastline. And in reference to Carl Ann and Craig's love story as declared publicly yesterday, this is where my love story uh, for this place we call home and hiking began, a story that would eventually lead me to the East Coast Trail. I've had the privilege and honor of leading and managing the East Coast Trail from a working concept uh, through the development and delivery of an internationally recognized destination tourism and recreational product for this province. The vision of the East Coast Trail has always been strong and committed to showcasing the best this province has to offer, experiencing and connecting with untouched natural surroundings, genuine communities, colorful culture, history, preserving and sharing natural areas. The East Coast Trail, viewed by many in 1994 as an impossible dream, has become a world-class attraction and a strategic project for this province that is generating significant economic, social, and environmental value. I'm very pleased and grateful to be recognized this evening for the 2024 recipient of the Target Tourism Champion Award. I've had the honor and privilege of working with a wonderful team of skilled and dedicated volunteers, along with the support and commitment of our governments, business, community partners, staff, and members. And h &L's validation of this accomplishment and the value of the East Coast Trail is adding to this province and indeed the country will serve us well as we seek dream number two, sustainable prosperity. I'm currently working with our board and our stakeholders to seek and achieve the long-term sustainability of the, of the trail and the association. Our objective is to ensure the trail continues to enrich the lives of our residents and the rural communities for many generations to come and to inspire the world to explore and love the province's great outdoors. Three decades ago this May, on the edge of Newfoundland, a group of like-minded people saw an opportunity, the chance to bring people and communities together. Where others saw wilderness, we saw well-being. Where others heard stories, heard silence, we heard stories. We dreamt of the woods, our coastline, and communities as a place for connection, a place to be proud of, a place where everyone becomes part of a connected community, and it's safe to say our dream has come true. This May, we will celebrate our 30th anniversary, and it has been a journey of meaningful connections that enrich our lives and, va and add value to our works, and the, the benefits basically flow right into our communities. The East Coast Trail is a resource that will keep on giving for many generations to come, but only if we provide the love, care, and protection it requires. So I've had the honor and privilege to be recognized here tonight, and I thank you all very much for that. So thank you, thank you, thank you, and much appreciated. And if you haven't been on the trail, this is our 30th anniversary. Come join, enjoy the raw natural beauty of the East Coast Trail and the 24 plus communities you'll find along the way. It'll enrich your life and it'll be time well spent. So thank you all.